Alright guys, Metasolar here, and we are in a matchup against Echo, and we're going to kind of see how we want to play this matchup, and you know what we want to do. First things first, guys, you have to recognize where your team's win cons are, and how to recognize that is generally just ask yourself, what is your best team's combo if you get into a team fight? For us, guys, that's just going to be a mid lane combo with a Malphite ult, and on the se second side is that the mid lane Talon is 75 LP Platinum. So, I don't know why he's in my game, but I'm going to uh, work with that. He's also 47% win rate. Go oh, eh, ball. Bot lane is their strongest laner with a 58% win rate on overall. While top lane is... He's okay. So, our goal this game is to play off of our mid lane. And then we're going to play from mid. Hopefully get him a lead if possible. And if we can't, guys, then we want to try to play off of bot lane instead. Alright, go ahead. On it one more time. I really hate when people do that extra auto attack. Like, you don't... Not, not necessary, man. All right? So we do that smite right there, guys. Because if I don't have Nimbus Cloak, then the best thing to do is just kind of have it walk towards me. And then while I'm waiting for my Tiger Stance to get up. And, you know, just get have it... You know, use that movement speed for me. And then kind of kite the camp backwards to my next camp. It's a little bit of a time save. Probably no more than like a second. But those little seconds, guys, can really mean the difference between you being in the right place at the right time. And then, you know, I waste that time space by canceling two auto attacks. Feels bad, man. One of the things I do like about playing... You guys, if you ever do want to do with an ADC, tell them to play Kai'Sa. Like, Kai'Sa gives the best leashes on the, in the face of the earth. You guys, you literally will have... You, you don't get a better leash than a Kai'Sa leash. You will be seconds ahead of your normal tempo. Alright, so against Echo, guys, one of the things you want to do is, if possible, get some good vision out there. They spotted me, they know I'm here, they know I'm here, so this really sucks for me. What that means for me is that overall, I'm just not going to really be able to make any aggressive movements. So instead, I'm going to just go ahead and try to go for a full clear. Um, Yasuo was able to get a first blood, awesome, and he was able to shove in the wave under the tower. That's a really good double bonus. No CC, no uh, flash mid means that I can actually start looking to go mid lane instead. So what I'm going to do here, guys, is I'm going to try to get level 4, and here's the crazy thing. I'm going to use my smite on the scuttle on the Krug because I'd rather be on the map than get a scuttle. Now, a lot of you guys, I think, put a lot of value into the into scuttles that you just don't need to. Scuttles are great to have, but they're not necessary for a win. And a lot of you guys will int a game away just to protect a scuttle. Like, you legit will just run it down. Alright, Nar got soloed by Malphite early. I don't even know how that one happened. Alright, didn't need to flash because I know he has no flash. He's next to a, he's not next to a wall. We just pick him off. Just like that. There's literally zero reason for me to uh, burn burn flash there, guys. And you know, we're just gonna make sure we keep those resources. To put a ward here, just see if the scuttle's been taken. Nope. Alright, cool. So now we got we got really good tempo, guys. And you know, we're gonna try to see if we can do that again. And just kinda keep talent outside of the game. So, Alright, we're gonna go ahead and back now. And one of the things before we back is we're going to put down a ward because we're going to swap the sweeper. Now, as you guys see here, we have a three-minute respawn of cooldown on our wards. When we pull up sweeper, we're going to have a much, 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 much lower cooldown. So we're going to finish our shop. Right, right there, guys, we have a whole minute before our next camp comes up, so we're in a good spot. Echo hasn't appeared on the map yet, so good things for us. There's a ward here, because you see how the... Ta so one of the things you got to do, guys, is also teach yourself how to watch maps. So you see how Talon walked down this way and then put the ward down? I know that he put... I know he uh, warded that area, because he knows I'm going to clear from this side of the map, and that's where I'm going to be. And I don't need to be on that side of the map. So instead, I'm going to work either towards mid or top. Top lane is actually uh, diveable. So that's what I'm going to kind of go look for. Alright, if Nar stays, I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna run his butt down. We're gonna run th through the tower. We're literally just gonna run right through the tower. I have flash, so. Boop. We're just gonna do that. Alright, he wants some. I mean, I can hold. Okay, he wants to shove it in. That's fine. So we. Again, you know, we're gonna. If, we're, if our top lane is gonna win a fight, we're gonna absolutely, you know, help him out a little. Why not? Hmm, I don't think that wave is going to shove in properly, dude. And I'm not going to be able to help you push that, shove it in any deeper. Because 
We shoved it a little too hard for the next wave. I mean, honestly, if he if he if he if he times this right, dude, you gotta back. I mean, if he didn't take two shower shots for free, uh, I could legit just sat with him. All right, I'm just sitting. I'm watching that because I need to make sure that Nara doesn't try to get uh, greedy to go hunt him down. And I was just there as a precaution. Awesome. All right, so Echo did Mountain Dragon. It does suck. I did want to get Mountain Dragon, but I'm getting my landers ahead, which is kind of more beneficial for me. Since we know Echo is on that side of the map, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and just counterside his blue. Blue can't and just take them all down. Hey, Donkey. You're welcome, my brother. So we're going to move our way straight into the next camp. For you and ever. Cool. All right, we're going to go ahead and do the same thing. Uh, we'll take the Blast Code if, if he pushes up, but if he doesn't, then, you know... We'll just walk around the tower. I don't care. Like, Malphite has such lane prio right now. Oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go ahead and use Tiger's Chance to kill the ward and leave. I don't really want to fight this, man. Like, it's just not a good idea for me to try to fight that. I took the cancer from... Oh, wow. Echo Echo's, like, coming deep into my jungle. Let's go ahead and see if we can counter that. Oh, he got level 6. And, okay. Alright. Let's see if we can go ahead and gang top lane. Boop. And that's how we did it done, guys. So we're we're good to go. I'm gonna go ahead and back and just... the w wolves do follow you for a little longer. I don't know why they do that, guys, but it's a little weird. But it's whatever. All right, at this point, guys, top lane is pretty much done. So, like, we've gotten a big advantage killing mid, killing top. We had a better mid lane win. So I know, guys, that early in the game, you know, I was saying, hey, you know, we want to focus mid, but mid lane kind of already won by itself. So at that point, guys, what you do is you just start working your map. You work your way around the map. All right, we're going to try to cut, cut off Echo's ult. So when he ults, he ults back into me. That's fine by me. Power Dive uh, just gave uh, two kills to my teammates. So, like I was saying, guys, you have to follow the tempo of the game. If my mid lane's already winning... I don't need to go, you know, sit in his lane because Talon is going to be a hard gank as it is. And there's free ganks for me to get top lane. By camping top lane like I have, I pretty much made this game a 4v5. Which, you know, it already was, but I pretty much pushed that scale down. And at this point, I just get a power farm and excel and just get really, really strong. Oh, he took my wolves. That's neat. Well, so what we're going to do, guys, since we're waiting for our cans to come up... And I'm getting going to get red buff, and then I'm going to go ahead and look to invade. Because I have the pressure in my team. I want to go ahead and take advantage of that. Tapping? It's probably me tapping against my desk, honestly. Ooh. I'm not going to be able to catch him anymore. He's going to just E over the wall. It's fine. As long as he doesn't get tower plates, I can delay his back. Oh, uh, that's that's what I hate that Terry that um his stun just completely ignore like if he gets CC'd while he's hopping over a wall, he just ignores the CC. All I'm gonna do here, guys, is just delay his back. Like that's the best thing I can do. If he's hit around here somewhere, I can at least delay that. If not, then I can look to get some deep ward in Echo's jungle. There we go. I just need to dot him and we'll walk out of this. Me, free double, sure. But you know what else? I don't really have um, anything to kind of contribute to them. So I want to be pressuring Echo because killing the Ezreal is just not going to matter. I want to keep their only source of AP pinned down as much as possible. Grab the free Rift Herald and use that to snowball mid. That's how we're going to win the game. 
We're not winning the game by, you know, diving the um, Ezreal Karma. And since I don't have Flash, guys, I have to be really careful about dives. Since I have a um, 400 gold bounty, I'm worth a lot of money if I die. I'm worth a lot of money if I die. So I just, I don't want to take those chances, you know? All right, we're going to go ahead and uh, give him Rift Herald, and then we're going to go mid. Wait, Nars down here? There we go. That works. Smited him, slowed him down. That's all I'm gonna do. And since we are an alt reliant team comp, guess what? Cloud Dragon is actually good for me to take and make it a priority because Malphite pretty much isn't a champion if he doesn't have R. Good fight. We used Aftershock to kind of uh, absorb some damage. Make sure that Echo can one shot us. We, I was saying we want to make sure we do a good smite so we don't lose it to Ezreal and then I like do the crappiest smite on the planet. Ah, well, I'm dead. I died trying to save Malphite from dying. Good, my bounty went to Karma. I should have just let him die. Like, those are some of the cases, guys, where you just gotta, you gotta ask yourself, was me going to play, was me doing that play actually worth it? Was me doing that play actually worth it? And that, and that was a case of hard, blind, line, no. By going for that play, I just kind of gave my bounty away to Karma, which was just pointless. Absolutely pointless. All right, well, let's see if we're going to go for a fight bot lane, and then that's what we're going to go join that. Ah. Yep. I think this is just not a good, going to be a good ult. Thought so. We're just going at them one at a time, Strap. I mean, that, it's fine. As long as, like I said, as long as Yasuo is unstoppable, we're good to go. But yeah, Udyr at the end of the day is always going to be a fun champion for me. I, I love him. Anyways, guys, so what we need to do now is next Rift Herald, next Dragon, those are kind of our big priorities, but we want to make sure we get Rift Hair um, Stair Skate as soon as possible. So if you're gonna kind of watch, I'm gonna I put focus on trying to get full clears in. I mean, we could we could kill this if Nami stays. We kill this. Oh, really? Like, what is the odds of just randomly warding this spot? Not even kidding. Of all the spots, she just warded right there. Like what? All right. It's so random. That's such a random ward. Like that, I'm not even gonna lie. That's such a random ward. That, like it doesn't matter. We're just, just Yasuo is just he's just blown up. We he got his first kill by himself, put himself in a good spot, and I just I sealed the deal. Like it doesn't matter. You're like, so relax. I'm literally just gonna spell it out for you, buddy. Legit, he's like, wah! Like, Mar it's, it's like legit, like, listen to Warrior. Wah! Why are we losing? I hate being on the two lane. Dude, he missed one R. I know, right? Frozen Heart, Spirit Visage. 
I, 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 my tanking is just spent. I, guys, you gotta know when to pull, pull out. You gotta know when to pull out, man. And I, I knew, like, that, that moment, mm, I, I'm low on HP. I'm good to go. I'll let my allies deal with it. That's the one good thing, though. The Ezreal doesn't know how low I am, so. You, I'm assuming he has a damn good reason to want asking for it, but, you guys, he's my carry. Holy crap, this Ezreal is annoying. He's my carry, so I'm just gonna give him what he wants. And there's Talon getting two kills. Alright, like, you- are you kidding me? Like, you guys legit are getting carried. Just let it happen. And this is why I say, guys, I legit wish that every surrender vote cost you one LP. So that constant spammers just lose LPA eventually. Oh no. We could actually lose this game if bot lane's mental doesn't like pick up real soon. I might have to actually babysit them just so they calm down. Like yeah, that's all we need to do. Just Mao go with him and I just shadow I just shadow them. And then we just win. Every fight. Every fight is won as long as those two start. Like well, that's what we need. We need to play off play off of, play off of Yasuo. Play off our combo, we win. I don't know why the support's... Uh, and we auto-win. Every team fight. Uh, I pr They got a lot of CC, but I, I think just sucking up as much damage is my goal this game. Alright, so let's just go ahead and grab Gargoyle. Yeah, don't stay bot then. It's, it's literally insane. Like, it, it, I'm not even kidding. It is insane, the fact that they're not just trying to 5-man right now. We, we win. Every 5-man. Force this. Like, legit, just for, force and turn. We ought to win this if they even think about coming next to us. Not even close, baby. Not even close. They didn't even come close to touching me, man. They didn't even break through my stairs gauge. See? I have no idea why. It doesn't matter. Oh my goodness. We will reset and grab that thing. I can't take this tower too long, so. There we go. Stun him. Stun him. Stun her. Kill them. And we're done here. See? Just had to chill. See? Easy peasy. Easy peasy, guys. Just play to your win cause and gun. Capiche. Be as possible. Dude, we can. 